we go through this every time. It's like, try playing with these. And I'm like, no. I don't want to. You try not telling me to play with those. Okay, so when we left off last time, we'd beaten the boss. Now we have to talk to the toad at the castle. Oh ho ho ho. No. Ho, ho. Do not want to connect. Look at this dog! Oh, I want to be him. I didn't want to hurt him. I wanted to be him. Shit. So, we are, uh... Now in the Mushroom Kingdom, and, you know, looking to talk to a, a toad, I guess, and do some toadly things. But, uh, yeah, so I beat, beat this last time, essentially. However, I want to keep playing. I'm having fun. So I've decided to continue playing and maybe try to get all the things. I say that with a big question mark. Because I don't know if I want to want to do it. What I'm going to do is play for a while and try and get many of the things. And then see how I feel about it. Ooh. Six sheep, you say? There's one. What do I do? Pick him up? Herd him? Oh, God. He just exploded. Well, I assume he's gonna pop. Okay, there we go. Da-da-da-da-da. I wish there was music here. I bet there is music once I... Oh, look at this castle. I bet there is music once I, uh... Do something that I'm supposed to do, right? Maybe I should go do the thing first and then make the music happen, just so this is a little more... Engaging? A lot of coins that are, uh... Not hidden at all, which I appreciate. That looked like a thing a Yoshi would eat off to the side there. What? She's gone again? I'm back in Mario 64, baby. I'm trying to search for this button in the dock. I'm playing this in the dark. It's a much more sensual way to play. How is that a moon? So she, okay, so now there's some, wait, she added to all of them. Well, shit. Now in that game, there was a little secret if you looked straight up, but I can't. You may need my top hat, huh? Give me your top hat. Dun, 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 dun. 
No? Alright. Should I keep going here? Should I go back to the beginning? I think I should go to the beginning. Right? Oh god. Oh god. What is this? Okay. It's not my favorite thing, this whole software updates and whatnot. I don't understand software updates on video games like this because I feel like why? Like what what happened to games? You know how many times I updated the Super Nintendo? None. None times. How would I know? My god, there's a million. Don't see it. Okay, well let's go. Let's go back to our first area. Because I think that held the secret to... 13 more! Oh, wait, there we go. Yeah. Cap Kingdom. Let's start here. So I think it was showing the metal block and saying like, Ooh, you could do something with this now. The moon block? I read this play one time called uh, Mr. Burns, A Post-Electric Play by, I think, Anne Washburn was her name. And uh, it was kind of about a post-apocalyptic, you know, version of our world. And, you know, it kind of takes place at different periods. Yeah, yeah. I want to check that out. Very much. So it was our, our world, basically, but it was slightly different because it was like uh, post-apocalyptic, right? And the main thing that happened was, uh, you know, it starts out and it's kind of just... Okay, here we go. Uh, it starts out like shortly after the apocalypse has happened and then uh, people are you know kind of forming into little groups and camping and stuff and they start telling each other you know uh, remembering episodes of the Simpsons oh okay swing What is happening? Oh my god! Wait a minute, so are these all new power moons? That's insane. What is this thing flying around? What is this? So is this one of them? Must be it, huh? Hidden in a sunken hat. So, you know, the first part is like 
apocalypse has just sort of begun, right? It's like a fresh apocalypse. And, you know, people are kind of gathering in small groups and camping and whatever, and they start telling Simpsons stories. And then by the end, it's like society has somewhat rebuilt. And there's kind of a, a form of, I guess, currency almost, which is um, groups of, like, actors basically put on performances of Simpsons episodes. Um, and do you think I went in here already? This is the danger of not having done everything right away. I have no memory of whether or not I did this. I'm gonna guess no. Uh, groups put on performances of like Simpsons episodes. And so like a currency becomes like if someone remembers the entire plot or like specific lines, you know, and they'll be like, oh, such and such group has, you know, three quarters of, uh, of, you know, the episode, whatever the name is, of the monorail episode, let's say. You know, stuff like that. Um, it was cool. It was like, uh, I don't know, it was a funny, interesting idea, because it's sort of like, yeah, I guess if the world collapsed, and, you know, there was like a want for entertainment, and some also like thinking of better days or something, I'd be like, yeah, Simpsons would probably be a pretty good touchstone. So that just had me thinking of it right now, because I was like, you just sort of described what's going on in this game to somebody. It would be like, this is nuts, man. Oh, shit. It's like, okay, so you fly around in a giant hat, <laughs> and you fly to, like, different worlds, and then you put your hat on different things, and that turns you into those things. And it's like, okay, buddy. You know, like, I, we all we've all enjoyed... You know, talking about, ooh, being on mushrooms or so, you know. <laughs> Give it a rest. Oh, fudge. Well. Hello? A little hard to judge these jumps. Which is fine, it's not like it's deadly. But yeah, I, I think I'd heard something similar, or seen something similar, or watched something where it was like that, but with Star Wars. Like, you know, someone was telling the story of Star Wars. Maybe it was like Walking Dead or something, and it's just kind of a little, cute little interlude where someone is, you know, they're all sitting around a campfire and someone's like, and then this happens, and whatever. It's like, and that's what Star Wars is. Someone was like, that's fucking stupid. In this play, too, it was like, you know, especially important, like, oh, somebody remembered the exact line for this joke or that joke, you know? Stuff like that. But yeah, it's like, for the most part, Mario games, it's like, well, the plot wouldn't be that interesting, right? Because there's not a whole lot of plot. But... Just like, do you remember this shit when you were doing this and whatever? And it's like, man, it's nuts that we made this. It used to be a world that made things like that. Came up with ideas of people flying around in a hat. Pow, pow, pow. Alright. I mean, I must be approaching a pretty close to finished level on this stage, right? Lists. Lists? 43 out of 50 hats. 9 out of 31 moons? I have barely any moons. Holy crap. Looks like a classic slide. Shit. 
<laughs> I already can see that that's going to be a problem. They see me rolling. <laughs> they don't like it. Mm. That was a good opportunity to jump, I suppose. Every once in a while, I end up reading a play. It's very rare. I think plays are probably more fun to write than they are to read. And you know, like, obviously it's like, well, a play's meant to be performed, but it's like, I mean, I don't think your average writer really has a whole lot of access to that, you know? Although I wonder, because like, okay, when I was in high school, I did forensics, which is like acting and stuff. It's not, uh, you know looking at dead bodies and everything. That would be a useful skill. Duet acting, I would not say, is an overly useful skill. Oh, shit. See, someone online was like, um, you, you can buy infinite moons. I mean, will it let me just buy a moon right now? Oh, I could buy 10? Oh my god. Wait a minute. So can I just keep buying these? But that's not fun. I want to get all the ones on the list. I don't want to get... Oh, skeleton? I wanna be skeleton? Look at this. Wait a minute. And dresses Luigi. Do you think these are like in all the stores now? Huh. Well, I think this is the way we're going. Man, I need a lot more coins. Uh, I well I. I was going to say I deeply regret not getting uh, more coins as I went, but I'm not going to go that far. I'm going to just say I regret. Hell yeah. There's a moon. Bam! Get me out of here. Should I do this? What is this running around? Why is he so fast? How am I supposed to get him? Damn it. I did it! Taking notes. I see what you did there. See, like, is this like, do I collect these? Should I have been doing this? Showing an arrow. 
do I know when I've got all the songs? There's a moon. See, this hat is looking very sparkly. Ah! Whenever it like zooms away, I'm like, oh damn it. Something bad's happening. Whoa. Can I please have that? Oh, really? How do I get him up here? I got a pair of Goombas for ya. <laughs> it's Princess! She's got a very classy outfit on. Quite realistic for her. I'm dressed as Santa. Let's see, I don't know if I can get that flying guy up here. How to find a fly? Uh huh. What do you think if I happens if I go? Do you think the princess will kill me? Get the hell away from me. He's not afraid of me, so this shouldn't be any problem. getting stuff in this stage. Ships beneath the fog, eh? Wooden crates. like a little hot and cold, huh? It's kind of in this area. Not there. Well, 
what the hell. I don't see any other wooden crates, though. Don't know where there's crates, guys. Swing! Said this is the wrong way. But it's. That bridge is also the wrong way. So it's somewhere. The clue was not very helpful. I got in the habit of ignoring coins. A regrettable habit now. I'm like half convinced that, uh, you know, turning all these lights on will do something. But I don't know how you would know if all the lights are on. And it's like, well, even if I thought all the lights were on and they weren't, then it wouldn't work, right? <laughs> but if it doesn't do anything... Until he tells me, tell me where it is. Swear to me. Yeah, I mean, I don't know what to tell you, buddy. I can't find it. This asshole. So much faster than me. Gotcha. Caught you hopping. The dark side of the moon? I feel like that's going to be a difficult area. Doesn't that seem like it's going to be hellish? Maybe not hell, but hell yeah. Should I try whatever this is? Oh, I see. It's 
so like other players can hide balloons and I can find them. I do this to escape the world and other people, okay? Cap Kingdom Master Cup. Out there. There's supposed to be a Goomba up here. Oh no, he's on the other end, isn't he? Blast. I mean, did I just do this? I feel like I just did this, but maybe not. Okay. That's kind of annoying. I wish that would go away. How do I know where there's a ship hidden in the fog? Like, it seems like there should be something there, right? Huh? Let's do this. Wait. See you. That's the most unhelpful clue I've ever seen. Fly to the edge of the fog. I didn't get that high. Or is it like, you know, relative to wherever I am? So now it'll sink me down. Hmm. I see. It was obscured by a wave. Go, go, go. do this with two hands in order to make that work. Like, yeah, can I go from, like, high point to high point? Is that how I make this happen? Get that guy there. He's way... Oh, that's probably just a frog, right? She is. Entering highway to the danger zone. I see. So the, the metal thing kind of complicates it because you can have gotten a lot of things up till now, but then 
need to uh, kind of re-explore areas again. That's kind of a bummer. I don't love that. No? Shit. Well, how am I supposed to get that then? I think that works. The old Yoshi abandonment trick. Hmm. <laughs> oh, these boxes came back. Don't like that. Maybe I gotta get a flying guy way up there, huh? Don't like that these boxes came back. That's not cool. We already did our thing. Oh. Give me my hat back. Top hat windows? What was that? run into these guys. Oh, okay. Well, I can I can actually make it not work. Turns out Hmm. I don't think that's a thing. Let's assume it's not. coins over there. Oh god. Oh dear god. Okay, well. Good news is, this is where I was headed, I guess. And then Mario passed out, so he died under the water. almost all the coins, so that's pretty good. Hey, I see you. I've learned a lesson from that, which is like when you have a vantage point, you should probably take it, take a look. So 
see what you see. so easy to miss one of these that it almost feels like it couldn't be that but also like gosh it would make so much sense though i'm in okay okay Lights are out. Damn it. Game and Mr. Game and Watch down there. Look at that. New record. Regular cup, huh? That one guy said something about like master cup. I think this is that. Like, have I done that now? Is it more difficult the second time? What is happening, everyone? does seem quite a bit faster. How am I s oh my god, how did he get over there? I'm gonna lose. Wait a minute, were there some of those go fast flowers somewhere? Can I do this with drugs? Is that accepted? some flowers. I see them. Oh yeah, maybe. Uh, do you think being the frog is fast? It can't be faster than the frog. <laughs> Last time I didn't have the like little stun, yeah, that thing. Maybe I got a roll at the bottom. Flowers, flowers. See those? Do you think this would work? Shit. Worse than ever. Damn it. I accidentally did something great the first time. Well, great. great. That's a, that's an overstatement, but, you know. All right. Come on. 
Like, I, I don't know. I haven't played this enough to know. Like, is there a trick? Should I be doing something tricksy or should I be, you know, basically just good at it? Is this a get good situation or a you gotta know the trick situation? Is it a race smart or a race hard? Oh, fuck. See, you bastard. What? How did he do that? Oh, damn it! He's so quick! That was slower than- Okay, I gotta figure out how to not do that. The stun, right? It's either gonna be Y or Z in Y. Or maybe just Z. I'll just try holding Z this time and see what happens. Maybe push it like now. Ha ha! Think you're in trouble, my friend. Time. That seemed like he was like a mile behind. There we go. Master Cup. Boom. Oh, he tells me that? Doesn't seem like there's anything left to do here. So that must mean there's nothing in here, huh? What a genius I am. Certainly he's not steering me wrong, right? He wouldn't be like, ah, oh, sorry, bro. <laughs> it turns out I was wrong. Okay, can I get like a Goomba flying guy up here by any chance? This is how I got here. Yeah, okay. Dumb dumb. How do I get way up there? I still had my frog. Can I get up there? Okay, I'm convinced the lights isn't a thing. Because it doesn't seem like that would work. Because it seems like they turned off, right? All these ships. Yeah, see if I can get way up high. too high for that, so maybe what if I can get on top of my own ship and that may do something. Boom. That trick I learned. There's a box. I'm 
Okay, I did see there was like a little ghosty flying around very fast. That seems like it'll be difficult to catch. Kind of way out there in the fog. It's gonna give me a different hint now. Secrets of the Frog Pond. I think this is that or that's upstairs. It seems like much more of a frog pond. Twenty-three of thirty-one and forty-seven of fifty. Looks like I got all the ones that were. Uh, should I go talk to this toad? How does this work? Do I give him money? Fifty coins. Yes. So that's this way, right? Oh wait. This is like telling me there's one out here. Somewhere. Right behind the Where'd it go? Oh, do you think that's the one that's moving? Okay, let's see if he's over by the bird next. Aha! Uh -huh. I see. I see. I guess I could try and plot the movements with the map. And figure out a good plan of attack here. But boy, is that a boring way to do it. The feeling it'll be coming this way. See you. Ah! Do a, a maneuver. I'm ready to do a move. <laughs> ah, shit. There's something right here, huh? I mean, it's not this, is it? I already did this. I did this already. God <laughs> bless you.
like right here. Oh, it's that one way up there, isn't it? Damn it. Can I get to any of these? Do you think if I hang out, one of these flies close enough and then I can sort of jump between them? That seems vaguely possible. Okay. I warp. Yeah, no. Or maybe I could just jump off the tower and get it? <laughs> Hmm. This is just crazy enough to work. Oh, it won't let me warp right now. He's like, did I just discover a technique for this game midair warp save? But no. Alas. Alright. Let's see, do any of these ships come anywhere close? here. Well, don't I get up there? Maybe I should go up there. He said there's nothing in here, but does that mean there's nothing at the top? And this is how I have to access the top, right? bad idea but in in fairness to me I'd already climbed it once how many times is you supposed to climb it before you get a little impatient Okay, so see, there's nothing to do in here. Oh. Okay, then. mean that I've got a clue for that one? Is that what that means?
Narrow pathway that dips into the fog. Back this way? It's like a little scavenger hunt we have to do? Happy. Narrow pathway that dips into the fog. That's not it. But shouldn't you have told me we were going the wrong way? This way, okay. Narrow pathway that dips into the fog. pathway narrow enough for you creepy Biggest hill. There? Or maybe that's back towards the beginning. That one. This is like a little step by step scavenger hunt, isn't it? Thank you. 
What's the moon? This is the moon. We went towards it. I think by this stake or something. Should I just go towards the moon? I guess this is a place they could put it. That you would never just find it. Nope. Oh, I think I'm not moving anymore. Okay, I hit the wall. start over? Do I start Cappy's thing anew? Cappy's hunt. Cappy's hunt. So it's like a sea hunt. Did I go to that one already? I think I did. Okay, so now I have to go back to him. Hey, I bashed the crates. What the hell? This can't change, can it? Oh, did I butt slam this? Is that what I did? Near a pathway that dips into the fog. I already forgot where that was, damn it. Okay. Isn't it? Smart to remember. This bridge turned out to be this bridge. Okay, this must be the glasses bridge. 
even though it's got a hat on it. Which moon? This moon? I just kind of go until he says, like, we're close. Okay, this, at some point, does he say, like, now we're close? First, I went toward the moon, from the hill to the moon. This is the wrong way. So it's somewhere between here and there? So close. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> this is going to be brutal. Holy shit. Guys. Oh no. 26 out of 31 and 47 out of 50. Frog jumping from the top deck, huh? Can you go over there? Okay, so this is frog jumping from the top deck. That's, that's gotta be that super tall thing, right? Yeah, from the top deck.
Can you go be on top of it? Hmm, I can get on this sail. There's a frog. I think that's higher? Do you think that's higher? This is higher, a little bit, but it's awfully far away. I just can't picture the distance being, you know. Okay, so I can't even do that. Well, that answers that question. I don't know, man. This might have to be a mystery for now. I might have to put this to bed. I think I'm hit my level for the day. So, uh, thanks for watching, everybody. This does make it seem like perhaps the quest to get everything in this game may be a little more than I bargained for. Boy. Good galley. I guess I can get tips. <laughs> Both of these guys are like secrets of frog. Okay, hold on. That's like right over there. How is this a secret of the frog pond? What's frog pond? Observe the frog pond with the thing? on top of it. <laughs> Alright. Well, that's a good for today. Um, <sighs> well, we'll see. We'll see. Guys, we'll have to get back to you and see how this goes. <laughs> I jumped into this with a lot of confidence about getting all the things, and I'm less confident now. You know, in my in my older age, I've gotten better at knowing when I'm in over my head. Not great, but better. <laughs>